here. Hey guys, it's Jana and welcome to Pinch of Luck. Today we are going to make this beautiful butterfly cake. Since spring is here, I thought this would just be so pretty. All of the ingredients and tools we will be using will be down in the description below. So let's get lucky. First, we just gotta make our cake. I am using a white cake so we can make it all spring colors on the inside. We wanna separate our batter into five parts. So just pour an equal amount in four bowls and leave a little bit in your mixing bowl. I have all these awesome colors here. Sky blue, lemon yellow, violet, and deep pink. So just mix your colors up into each bowl. Now I have an eight inch round, so just spray this down and start pouring your batter in. Just keep pouring all your colors right in the middle. And then we're gonna use a knife and just kind of mix it up a little bit. Get it all marbly. Wow, these colors are amazing. I'm loving these Americolors. Now just throw this in the oven at 325 for about 40, 45 minutes or until your toothpick comes out clean. Now that our cake is completely cooled, let's go ahead and throw it on our cake board and put on a crumb coat. Now we just need to make our marble fondant. We are going to color a little bit of white fondant each color that we used in the cake. Now we're just gonna squish them all together and make them all marbly. Just roll this out and place it on your cake. Take a pizza cutter and cut off all the excess and smooth it out with your smoother. I have these butterfly cutouts that I got on my Amazon haul. I am very excited to use them. So with your leftover fondant, go ahead and cut out a bunch of butterflies. We're also gonna make some white butterflies too. The best way to dry your butterflies so they look like they're flying is using a book. Just open your book, put some wax paper on there, and place your butterflies right in the seam. You're gonna wanna let these dry for at least a few hours if not overnight. Now that we have the butterflies all drying, let's roll out our second piece of fondant, the white. Now we're gonna take our butterfly cutter and cut little butterflies right where we want them on the cake. Now just carefully lift your fondant and place it on your cake. It looks so cool with the marbly coming out. Use a brush with some water to help glue down the second layer of fondant. Cut off your excess and smooth it out. Now it's been a while so our butterflies are nice and dry. So I put a little bit of icing in a piping bag and I'm just gonna use that to glue the butterflies on wherever I want. Oh my goodness guys, I love this cake. It is so cute. Now let's see how the marbling looks inside. Wow, those colors look amazing. I love it. Happy spring, everybody. I think we got lucky. Be sure to click my face to subscribe and check out some other videos. If you guys make this, send me a picture and if there's anything you wanna see, just leave a comment down below. And as always, if you loved it, like it, subscribe to it, and share it. Thanks, guys. Mwah.